And sixth, we wanted to show how each of the family members were equally culpable for what happened in the past event. It wasn't just Dorothy. How was Sean responsible for what happened to the child? You learn in these flashbacks that he should have been there and he feels really, really guilty about it. And it's driving part of his learning about the cult. Explain it to me. I know she's special and you, but I don't understand, so please tell me. I mean, it's definitely a supernatural thriller, but as grounded as we can make the supernatural part is the trick, so it doesn't crack and it becomes rule-less. We want it to have rules. What was he saying about me? He said we have to return you to where we found you. He said you're needed there, so... And you believe him? I don't know what I believe. For example, in this episode, we're meant to learn what the ramifications are of Leanne's actions. There's a little bit of Leanne taking on the personality of the Turner's lives, and the house itself is taking on the presence of her being in this home. She caused this. Some of it's cracking, some of it's changing, and I think we can all connect with the idea that maybe there's something out there that we don't understand, the unknown that we can't make sense of.